I don't view Elon as some sort of genius. He had an extremely privileged upbringing with a lot of money. Sure, he's taken some chances, and he's made a lot of money doing it. Making a lot of money doesn't make someone a genius, although it does usually mean someone is good at something. Just because someone is good at one thing doesn't mean they're good at everything else. I think Elon has completely destroyed morale within Twitter. He has been more brutal of an owner than anyone I can recall in the last couple decades. His decisions increase the likeliness of someone within the company sabotaging the company. Yes, most Twitter employees had cushy jobs. They had so many amenities available. But that shouldn't mean that the firing of thousands of people should be met with the attitude of, Ha ha, take that, you snowflakes. They're draining the swamp. Yes, I get that the people being fired get three months' pay, but that's still the firing of thousands of people during a recession that could become a depression. And there are hundreds of employees, crucial employees, who have resigned after Elon gave an ultimatum. Elon has basically shut down the offices for the weekend. Some people think that Twitter won't make it through the weekend. We'll just have to see. I think it'll be fine over the weekend with some hiccups. And then I think there'll be a bunch more hiccups over the next couple weeks, especially after he implements the, uh, the verification system again. It re-implements it in a way that's, that can cover more people. I, I think he's supposed to be having it on Android and uh, the iPhone instead of just the iPhone. And, uh, and it's going to require a few more things. I don't know exactly what those things are yet, but supposedly it's going to be more robust but uh, after that goes into place, yes, there's going to be a bunch more problems. And uh, it, Elon is most definitely going to have to hire more people to, to do a lot more stuff. But, I mean, they're going to be different jobs than, than what, what the people were doing before. So, I don't know. I mean, I can understand that uh, uh, him wanting to gut <laughs> Twitter to replace it with something else. But... This may not work out so well for him, you know? We'll, we'll just have to see, right? I mean, we can be assured that more advertisers are going to pull out on a massive scale. And we'll see if Trump's account is reinstated. Elon put up a poll, um, and it seems that, you know, most people are... I mean, it's, it's, it's in the 50s for, uh, uh, for Trump, so it's not like this huge, huge margin, but uh, still... Uh, yeah, Trump seems to be uh, winning in that poll. I have a feeling that Elon really does want to to reinstate Trump's account, but uh, he wants to be able to say, "Hey, look, uh, the, the the people said uh, to to reinstate it." Right? We'll see what happens there. I know a number of people who have said that they're going to quit Twitter if Trump is reinstated. I'm like, well, okay. But overall, if Twitter ceases to exist in a few months, eh, it's not going to really bother me very much. It just means that an echo chamber has been dissolved and it will have to form somewhere else. To me, Twitter needed to change, even if it means no longer existing. As it's been said, Twitter was losing millions all the time. And it was eventually going to fail if Elon hadn't bought it. And perhaps he's just hastened the process, like so many people are trying to say. Mainstream media is saying, oh, it's, it's the end of Twitter. You know, everyone, so many people are saying, this is the end. He just, he just, just completely destroyed it. And it's just like, well, we, we still don't know that, but it's possible that, that, that he destroyed it. But perhaps he'll make it into something better. We'll just have to see. You know, again, I'm not going to act like Elon is some sort of genius. Twitter might end up destroying Elon. I question whether the Cybertruck will ever actually make it into production. But I tell you, the mystery, suspense, and drama of this situation has been incredibly entertaining. Far better than any TV show, that's for damn sure. Anyway, thanks for watching.